Hi everyone, welcome to Fine Wine of the Old World. Today I'm very excited because we will talk about my favorite grape variety. And yes, I know I feel very guilty about that. I always say, oh yeah, this is my favorite. Oh, this is my favorite. But this time, trust me, this is the favorite of the favorites. <laughs> so yes, I'm very excited to talk to you about Saperavi. So I hope you enjoy the video and I hope you drink responsibly. Saperavi is a grape variety that is mainly grown in country of Georgia, mainly in Kakheti region. And it's very special because A, it is my favorite grape variety and B, because it is a part of the group called Tenturie and that means that the red anthocyanins are not only in the skin but also in the pulp. So if you translate the name of the grape in Georgian that would mean dye but not like dye <laughs> but because of the potential to stain easily. Yeah it means that the skin and the pulp gives this very intense color to wine and today also I have this um, Saperavi which comes from Kakheti region and it's absolutely amazing so probably at the end of the video I will show you that <laughs> I'm the perfect example of drinking and responsibly but yeah. I really like the Saperavi wine because the wine is normally aged in stainless steel vessels or the oak and then also in my favorite Kfebri. Once I went to the wine expo and there was a lady that actually lives in Georgia and she gave me the wine that was made in the stainless steel and she also gave me the wine that was made in Kfebri. And even though it was the same vineyard, the same winemaker, the same grape variety, it tasted totally different. The exact origin of the grape is actually unknown but it is believed to be um, Caucasus. And what is so special about vine itself is that it can um, grow nicely in the cooler regions, in the high altitude when the difference between the day and night can vary a lot. Sometimes you can find Saperavi as a blend and you probably would find Kakuri Mitzvane or Rikatseli um, grape varieties and probably that would be a good idea for the next episodes. There are some very notable Georgian wines and that would be, for example, the semi-sweet wine, which is Kidzmaruli, Akasheni, Alazani. And also you can find the wine Saperavi that would be aged for three years. And that would be Mukuzani or Naparuli. Those are definitely remarkable wines. There are obviously other names, which is Kerki Nagok or Sapo or Klein Beriger, um, but mostly you would definitely find it under the name Saperavi. There aren't many countries that grow um, Saperavi grape variety, but you could definitely find it in Azerbaijan, Uzbekistan, Ukraine, Moldova, but um, I know there are actually some other experiments in other countries and the New World as well. And uh, it seems like winemakers are very interested in this grape variety. And now we can finally go to my favorite, which is the assessment. So when it comes to the color, you can see it's black. Hmm? <laughs> no, that's actually ruby red, but very intense that people actually call it black sometimes. In terms of aromas, I can firstly tell you what I can smell in my wine. And there's definitely a lot of tobacco, some earthy notes, smokiness, so complex. Really, really, really nice, especially if you like the full body red wines. Mm, you should definitely try it. The other aromas you could find potentially in this wine would be obviously the black fruit, which is blackberry, blackcurrant, plum, but also you can find some leather notes and spice and sometimes minerality. And when it comes to the taste, the very high acidity, high tannins, and as I already said, full body. So um, if you like full body, please do try it. And if you think of what to pair with the full body wine, you probably would think of meat, and something that is very rich and um, hearty dishes. 
And I must say that the other day I went to the Georgian restaurant and it really impressed me because that was definitely an experience that I have never had before. So the dishes, the Georgian dishes, Georgian cuisine is so different to, to I've had before. For example, I would recommend you kacho, which is the beef soup and it's very hearty. So it would definitely go very well with your saperavi. Chanaki, which would be the lamb stew and it has a lot of spices so that would definitely go really well and i would say also gozitan raviul which is cheese and pasta especially that you should remember that the tannins go really well with the fatty and creamy dishes and now in terms of aging so yeah we have tannins we have high acidity so obviously the wine would be aging very well and you could definitely be able to keep your wine for five to ten years and maybe it would even develop some extra complexity even though it's already very complex wine lastly yes i know unfortunately we won't talk any longer about saperavi but the keywords so i would say kakheti region in georgia oak barrels and kefevri full body high acidity red anthocyanin in skin and pulp, Georgian cuisine and very good potential for aging. So yes, I hope you enjoyed my video and I hope you are going tomorrow to the shop to get the Georgian wine and I hope you have a wonderful wine in your glass and have a good day, good evening and see you soon. Bye!